So those of you that have now tried Zook or want to know what is Zook doing and how we discovered how it changes and regulates pressure, you first have to understand how the brain functions. Okay, the brain located here with the brain stem underneath the cerebellum. The brain stem is where all the input comes. When you have an ear and then you have your ear canal and you have your tympanic membrane here, and you have a series of bones that connect to your cochlear apparatus, and then you have your otolithic and vestibular apparatus. These two systems come together, creating the vestibular cochlear nerve. They go in through the brain stem and locate here on the vestibular nucleus and the, where the cochlear nerve branches off and sound travels. This system is also regulated out here, the sensory system and these bones of this tympanic membrane, the tympanic membrane itself and the external ear are heavily influenced by cranial nerve five and cranial nerve seven, the facial nerve and the trigeminal nerve. This facial nerve and trigeminal nucleus also exist here in the pons and the pons is where most of the rest and digest regulation of the brain. So when there's stress, when there's tension, when there's pressure, a lot of times there might be pressure in your inner ear like you feel like when you go up the mountain. So then you have a eustachian tube also located inside that ear canal where this fluid exists and all this pressure radiates up to the brain and this goes to the mouth that then allows pressure to change within this ear apparatus and so that's why people will pop their ears so to speak by opening their jaw to get the eustachian tube to function but that's just using the muscles of mastication the trigeminal nucleus when you use the pressure gradient and use the tympanic membrane, you get higher and more input into this vestibular cochlear cranial nerve 8 nerve, which then alters the brain stem's function one side to left side. A lot of pressure imbalances and tension is that one side is more activated than the other. And so when you use Zook, to change this pressure or to add air against this external outside, it can alter this and be very specific to one side and calm and change that pressure and, re and allow calmness, allow relaxation, all to occur because of a little change in the pressure that is placed against this neurological system.